What's going on, Julian? Me, CJ. <laughs> hey, man, can you tell all the people at home what you do for a living? Personal trainer in California. Oh, man, well, he's more than a personal trainer to me. He's my friend. He's my number one student, but at the same time, I feel like I'm his number one student. He's the one that helped me make the transition from martial arts to personal training. So I owe a lot to this brother, and uh, I'm so honored to have him come in and participate in this video. Um, so how are you feeling right about now? Awesome. Hey, you ready to show him what we do, how we do it here, brother? Let's do it. All right, let's do it. Like I said earlier, you can take this workout anywhere you want. You can do it on the sidewalk, in the parking lot, at your office, at your dojo, it doesn't matter. You can train and break out and bring your tools of the trade and start working. Unfortunately, Julie and I are bank robbers and we ended up in this empty warehouse. So uh, the police are coming, the, the, the alarm is sounding, we got no choice. So the police will be here in about 10 minutes or so, so uh, we might as well make a work out of it. I'm just playing you guys. Hey, we're here at my facility that'll be opening next month. So uh, it's kind of playing now, but uh, wait till next month. All right, so we're gonna get right off into our advanced workout. So uh, let's say that we're done boxing, but we wanna still get that boxer's feel. We wanna feel every part of our body being taxed and worked. So here's another way we can do it. I'm gonna work uh, Julian here through this circuit drill. Like I said, it's kind of advanced, so don't try this until you're ready, until your conditioning's up. So I'm gonna walk over here and uh, we're gonna coach Julian through this series. What he's gonna do is he's gonna run through the series twice, run back, hit it one more time, and then run to the jump roll. I'll explain it as we go. Hey Julian, you ready to train? Let's do it, Julian. Go! These are ball raises. The key to the trick to the trade is he's gonna do this 20 times. He's gonna raise it over his head and bring it back down underneath his chin. Offense, defense. The punches go up, the punches come back down, you protect your body. As soon as he puts this ball down, he's gonna run to the next apparatus. These are sidewinders, side to side. He's gonna do 20. Two, three, four. See how the count? Five, six, seven, eight. Pick up the pace. Nine, 10, 11. Good job. 12, 13. 14, 15, look at him breathe. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. He's gonna step forward, he's gonna give me 20 squat jumps. Explode, Julian. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Look at the elevation. 10, 11, 12, 13. Continuous motion. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 19, 20. All right, let's hit these alternating push-ups on the BOSU. Good. If you don't have a BOSU, you can just do straight push-ups, but explode. Come off the ground a little bit. If you can't do a straight push-up, go to your knees, but don't arch your back. Keep everything nice and stable, head level. Good. You're going to use that BOSU. The top of the ball, you're going to push off, feel that energy, and explode off it. That's how you develop that speed. That's how you develop that quickness. When he gets up, he's going to run back and start the drill all over again. Good. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna let you watch Julian on his own. Go ahead, Julian, explode, get it. Yep, keep those elbows in. This is the second round. The more in shape you get, the more rounds you can do. We're at the one minute and 45 second mark right now. Keep pushing. The goal is to see if you can get to the end twice before time runs out. And it looks like he's almost there. Two, three, four, five, six, come on, seven, eight, you got one minute, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Jumps, let's go, let's get it done, let's get it done. 50 seconds, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Now while, I, while he's jumping and I want him to breathe and maybe he's a person that's holding the breath, I tell him to count, count. 16, 17. That way I know he's breathing. 19, 20, 30 seconds, bro. Give me 20. Let's go. You count it. Two, I know he's breathing when he's talking. Four, five, we don't want to hold our breath. Eight, seven, eight, he's almost there. Nine, when he's done, he's going to run over to this jump rope. 12, Push. 14, 15, 16, 18, 19, All right, over here. Over here to the jump rope, Jules. Go, 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 go. Pick up that jump rope. I need one minute, Julian. One minute. Go hard. Knee highs. Go hard. Ready? Go. Don't stop, Julian. Believe it or not, this is how he recovers. He's in such good shape, he's recovering with the knee highs. He's recovering with the jump rope. This is what you want your guys to elevate to. So instead of stopping and this is the way he's going to recover. This is the elevation. Can't wait for you guys to try it.
Keep going, man. Guess what, guess what? 25 seconds, Julian. Notice he has a breathing rhythm. He's not holding his breath. You got 15 seconds, man. When you're done, you're gonna put that rope down like it ain't nothing. Five, four, three, two, time. Good job, man. How you feel? Awesome. <laughs> Good. Hey, so that's, that's a variation. That's an advanced stage. Um, but like I said, don't try this until you're ready. Uh, after he sees, uh, go ahead and pan the camera over to Julian here. So even though he's in great shape, he's had a couple of fights in his life. Hey, this is a work. This is a workout. This is what I want it to be. You'll appreciate it. How about that?